Michigan campus right now, on the main part of campus. There's a lot of people walk through here. They're just trying to capture what really goes on around here. You can say it's a hobby, photography. You know, uh, it's one of the things I just picked up. You know, I, I kind of already like taking photos. I just like to take pictures of what's going on. Right, uh, I took a photo of the flag, and then uh, I heard a helicopter flying over and looked up, and uh, it was actually flying over top of the flag. Got this photo right here. My thing is like catching the moment. Like people don't see me, but I see you. Maybe explain what was going on that day, or your emotions towards something or things like that. It just kind of helped me view things differently now. 10 seconds to go, fourth and two. This is the picture from uh, <laughs> the last play from a couple years ago. I remember this play like back in my hand. Whoa, he has trouble with the snap. This picture, you can see Michigan State's players running full speed to the punter. Blake's trying to get the punt off. Michigan State's Jalen Watts Jackson, and he scores on the last play of the game. Unbelievable! One of the probably the greatest plays in college football history, and that uh, you can just see the emotion of the team. You know, they're really happy. Beat us, which is their in-state rival. This face right here looks like he has a lot of frustration. He doesn't look sad. He's kind of mad you know, about what just happened. He definitely doesn't see the photographer taking the picture. So the photographer did a great job of being the fly on the wall. That feeling, you know, it sucks. Seeing the other team walk up a tunnel, your tunnel with the trophy that you really wanted. I want to keep the trophy here in Ann Arbor. For me, my fifth year, I want to go out on top. First time being a night game against Michigan State in Ann Arbor. It's going to be a great atmosphere. It's on time. It's on time. We ain't got to lose. You punch them mouth every play. Every play. Go start the finish. They don't Let's finish go! the finish. Good evening, everybody, and welcome to prime time. This is the backyard brawl. This is the Hatfields and the McCoys. Chris Fry said it earlier this week. They don't like us, and we don't like them. Ball Cut to his left. He is hit got it. at the 45. The ball is loose, and guess who's got it? Spartan, first and ten. Play fake with Stewart on an end around. He'll oh, three it right side to Madre London. At the ten, at the five, hits for the He's right pylon. Touchdown, MSU. Well, right now, the Michigan offense, you can't ask your defense to get you back in this thing. You got to do it yourself. Oh, corn. Getting pressure. Now bails out of the pocket right. Look, throws. Ball's caught inside the 20 to the 15 yard line. And he'll pound his way into the end zone. Touchdown, Michigan. Well, let's play football because now we got a game. Rain's getting a little bit heavier here at Michigan State. That Michigan State front four has had its way with Michigan's offensive line. Throws over the middle, it's intercepted. Another pickoff for the Spartan secondary. Michigan with five turnovers today. We might as well face the reality, and we are not even an average offensive team. And the Wolverines will get it at the 20 with 34 seconds left and no timeout. Takes it out of bounds over the 30 to the 35 yard line, and there's a late hit oh, on Michigan on. State. 13 seconds left to play in the football game. Higdon has it. He goes out of bounds at the 38. With five seconds left, they trail 14 to 10. Ball at the 37 of the Spartans. Okorn takes the snap. Going for the end zone. Hail Mary. It's down. No good. The Spartans break it up as time runs out. The Spartans win at Michigan, 14 to 10. Uh, you back, baby? You back? You back? You back.